Welcome to another quick Cinema 4D tutorial. Um, so I was playing around with doing some operations that required me to calculate uh, surface area and realized that there's not a extremely straightforward way to do that in Cinema 4D without a plug-in. And it's a little bit difficult when you actually start looking for a plug-in out there. So let's just say, for instance, I'm trying to calculate some surface areas of some of an object that isn't as simple to measure as something like this. You know, let's say that it's got some unique features to it um, that make it not that easy. And so in the case that we were exploring, um, we were taking some drone footage and exporting some OBJs and we were trying to basically see if we could do a calculation for um, a pool cover size um, for a friend's business and kind of ran, ran into this issue and so um, obviously no swimming pool is going to look quite like this but just to give you an idea of you know sort of maybe some unique shapes that you would like to measure surface area for um, we've got this interesting looking polygon that I just maybe, maybe it looks like a an airport terminal or something but anyway so the plugin I put a link in the description um, and when you go to the link you're gonna notice first and foremost that everything is pretty much in French um, you can translate in the upper right hand corner to English however for some reason that wasn't working for me so anyway universal symbol here for download Oh, that's English. So just we're just going to click this folder. We're going to download it, and then we're going to come over. And we're going to look at how to install. And then you've got this nice little GIF here that shows you um, basically what you need to do. And it's just simply dragging this whole folder into your plugins folder. So if I go into my preferences and open my preferences folder. Um, basically what they want me to do is and here let me actually go to my cinema 4d plugins folder there and let's get out of this so I can actually access my desktop um, there's the folder that it says vonk ervol so I didn't set this up very well for you guys but Go back in, drag that folder right into plugins, and voila. We should be good. Now it's not going to show up yet, so I'm just going to save this as surface area, and I'm going to quit and relaunch. Okay, so I'm back in now and I'm just gonna go into my plugins and I'm gonna pull up it's nice and labeled as area and volume so with my object selected I just hit calculate and I get a nice square footage of 216.6975 square feet um, and what you'll notice is if I go in here and I start making changes um, I think it's set to auto update right now look at that now we're at 221. Look at that. 233. Okay, so you can do area just like that. Um, or you could come in here and you could actually measure the cube volume, um, which is also potentially very beneficial if you're someone who's doing using Cinema 4D for rendering and architectural design and things like that. Um, that's a very, I found this to be a very useful tool. Um, probably something that's indispensable if you're actually designing something for um, that you want to be scaled to real world size. So that's been a quick tutorial on how to measure area and volume uh, using a simple plugin, simple free plugin in Cinema 4D. Thanks for watching.